Well, right now they're worried about the welfare, you know, not just about tonight, but the future of this fight and what damage he will take now because he can't see correctly. It's their job to protect the fighter. He tried to nab him up top, but was unable to connect. Here he comes, nice and aggressive, red hot going after it. Much the way he finished up the action the last time we saw him in the last round. Hey, look, if you're a fisherman and the fisherman was good in a certain spot, <laughs> you can't wait to get the boat out to that same spot. He's rolling right out there. That's a bitter hook by Bishop. Eddie, you've been in spots. Wow, impactful, short, big shot there. Well, he's been there before, and now he's there again. He got floored. He can't afford to keep going on that floor. You have to wonder when the referee's going to step in now and stop this. There's just no quit in this guy. He's been damaged, but still he's trying to make a fight of it. Look, I love that about him. The fans love that about him. It's great. But he's got to learn when it's time to turn it off, when it's time to clinch a little bit, survive a little. Fires off that hook. Bishop's corner has to give him some advice here because that left hand has been scoring two consistently. Exactly, Joe, and there's nothing else that he really has to worry about. Take that out of the equation, he'd be winning the fight. Good left hand able to land. Right to the head with that right. Bishop's hoping to recover right here. The way to do it, he feels to tie up. Yeah, it's not about machoism right now. Oh, a big shot comes home for him. How is he going to survive this? Once again, he hits the deck. He's going to have to find a way. One, two, three, four, five. And it's all over. Manfredo's power just much too much for his opponent. Another knockout for him. Ladies and gentlemen, by way of knockouts, your winner here, the Florida Providence, Manfredo Jr. I don't know why we're always so sure.